Manhattan at the moment. Here's our parking garage. Um, I think we're trying to head down to see the 9-11 memorial. We're gonna try to do a, what the heck is going on with my hair? I'm sorry, it's been a long drive. We're gonna try to do the, there's like a big play or toy store. Um, there's a Lego store, a whole bunch of fun stuff. My family is over, over there eating in the car right now so I just stepped aside so I could talk to you guys but I'm gonna get back over there so we can uh, we can we can start our day so one of the first things we did when we got to New York was to see the 9-11 museum now this is one of those things that I've been really wanting to see for a long time and has been on my bucket list for a really long time this was incredibly touching I can't even explain the impact it had on me there was actually even the steel piece from the tower that they had on display and that really touched me as well. Not to mention this room that we walked into, I almost immediately started crying, but there was just thousands of pictures of still missing people from the attacks. It had a bunch of displays laid out and honestly, there was just no time to be able to see everything. Once we got back into the city, I saw this gorgeous mural, New York. Honestly, the city itself isn't the cleanest thing in the world. I was a little bit disappointed, but they really had some beautiful pieces of art and these buildings were just amazing. They were incredibly tall. The skyscrapers were so cool. And standing right outside of this mural here of 9-11 was this guy and he really knew his stuff about 9-11. Some people don't know that, but I'll ask. I was incredibly blessed today to be able to see um, the Ground Zero uh, location and it was just breathtaking. I can't even come up with the word of what it did to me to see this. I had been wanting to see Ground Zero for a very, very long time and actually being able to stand on the edge and to see the waterfall. Um, was just truly something else. It was just incredible to know that I was standing in this spot where thousands of people lost their lives and it was just honestly awe-inspiring. Also, we saw a quick glimpse of the Empire State Building, which I thought was really cool. And then we made our way to Rockefeller Center, which I went to as a little girl and ice skated, but it was way too crowded. We were shoulder to shoulder with everybody. Um, but it was really, really cool to bring my daughter and let her see. And here's a little picture of that uh, golden statue you can see in the movie Elf. Um, the Lego store was also right next door, but the line to get in was absolutely ridiculous. But yeah, there is the massive Christmas tree as well. It's just really awesome to see in person. And they even have a little restaurant right next to the ice rink, which I didn't know about until this trip to New York. So that was really cool to see. And I would really love to eat there someday. Also, we went to FAO Schwartz, a massive toy store. Um, again, unfortunately, I really would like to make another trip to New York because we weren't able to go in because the lines were far, far too long and we only had one day to see everything. Another thing on my bucket list, we actually got into Times Square and this was a couple days before New Year. So we got to see the stage set up. We got to see where they were gonna drop the ball. Again, I mean, you look at the video, it was ridiculously crowded. We did, however, get an opportunity to go into the Reese's store and that was really awesome. But once again, I wasn't able to really look around too much. So we definitely need to make another trip. Finally, when I got home, I decided to play with Arrow with my husband and I in bed, and we probably had the best time just sitting there and absolutely cracking up. Yeah, I love it. Didn't sound like a trumpet. <laughs> Bob. You think he got it on the camera? <laughs> Can you play it back? Hey, I will show you when I'm done. <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs>
<laughs> oh my goodness, oh, this I is have the best thing ever. Oh my god, I'm like crying because I'm so tired. <laughs> I can't breathe through my nose. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. They won't stop. The tears won't stop coming. Oh my gosh. Get them. <laughs> oh, there's a big mama. Get them. Get them. <laughs> Crikey. At what point is. do you think he's like, what's going on here? Why can't I catch him? <laughs> In his natural habitat. <laughs> <laughs> You're fucked. <laughs> Praying on the fish around him. Look at that yellow. Oh my god. Oh. 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 Okay.